everyone, I'm here with an unboxing video. I have the latest Witches Roots box to open for the month of March. I usually get these at like the end of the month. Um, I guess because being in Canada, it takes a little longer to get here, but that's okay. Um, so again, we have the beautiful box. Um, a lot of people said they preferred this view as opposed to like the top down view. So I'm going to continue doing it that way. I do not know what's in this box. I just kind of cut off the packaging around it, but I have not opened it yet. Um, and so you will see my honest to God reactions um, as I open this. So let's open. As always, we have our tissue paper on top. They present it very well. And we have our instructions that, well, not instructions, but the list of everything that we have here as well as our theme. I like to guess what the theme is as I open it, so we will open that in a second. All right. Ooh, first off, we have here some beautiful artwork. So we sort of have this sort of Celtic knot tree it's sort of an as above so below we have the root system we have the branches we have the lunar cycle going all around it or is it supposed to be maybe it's supposed to be this way maybe it's like the sun these are the roots yeah i think it's supposed to be this way okay so we have like the four elements here on the tree we have um the the waning and waxing moon we have the moon cycles all around we have the root system here and then we have the sun so i think that's the way it's supposed to be Next, we have our, ooh, our um, herb of the month is basil or basil, however you want to pronounce it. Um, I love basil. I like, it's, it's delicious and yummy. And I really associate it with like wealth and abundance and positivity. Um, so they have some beautiful artwork here along with the associations with it. Magical properties. The scent of basil creates sympathetic connections between people soothing tempers and something in relationships anyway i will look at that closer but beautiful artwork for your book of shadows so two beautiful pieces of art here Ooh, we do have something in this Ooh, i'm gonna guess it's breakable because it is wrapped in um this foam which i'm gonna keep because I always try to reuse what I can. Oh, well, this is very pretty. Very, very cool. Oh, look at this. We have a beautiful little green man plaque. I'm going to have to find somewhere. Got a little thing on the back. I'm going to have to find somewhere to, to hang him. He is really, really cute. Oh, that is so wonderful. Okay, I'm going to find a nice spot for him. Gonna have to recycle that or reuse that. Okay, so of course we have here basil. I have to spell it. I love basil so much. This is definitely a welcome addition to the apothecary. Oh yeah, that's nice. Okay. Welcome addition to my collection. I tend to use basil for things like abundance, luck, success. I really do see this as like a really positive herb. I really associate it with like Jupiter and stuff like this very expansive type of energy. Very, very delicious. This is a very green energy type of, um, of box is what I'm getting. We also have here our spring blessings ritual incense. So that's the incense there. I do like that they put them in these packages now with a label on them because now, because the old boxes I have like a bunch that I don't know what they are. I just smell them and think, does this smell good? Well, that's nice. Very, very fresh. Very fresh. I like that. So I, I'm, I'm guessing this is a spring themed green, greenery themed box. We also have our candle in here. Let's see, I'm, I'm going to guess it's green. Let's see. Oh, yes, it is. It is green. Okay. Unwrap it. It is a beautiful light green color yes green candle smells like beeswax sometimes they smell like things sometimes they don't i think that's it there's usually a stone in here but i think because of the plaque they don't and we have our oil why did i not bring my scissors i did bring them downstairs but i think i where did i put them oh they are here they are here i don't want to break this plaque I'm moving things around and i'm like eh, i don't want to break things okay gonna cut this 
can't see me, but I'm cutting this. I know it's boring, but I'm going to guess this has like a very, like, like it's like a springy green kind of oil. If I can get it open. Come on. Um, but this is a very, a very springy type box, which I really love because I could use some spring energy. Um, it is very, it is very spring here, actually. Spring has come a bit early here, but it's, our spring is very very brown it's very brown all right we have something I think it's spring blessings oil oh it's very light very fresh there is like it's herbal but there's a slight floral element in it so beautiful oil there so I'm gonna put that aside I think that's it for our box this month. I shall put the box. Where shall I put the box? Uh, let's put it down here for a moment. Pick that up in a sec. Anyway, okay, so let's see what our thing says here. I'm gonna guess the theme is spring blessings. Okay, the spirit of spring. So it says, as we move towards Astara, well, we're past Astara, but that's okay because spring here comes late. Um, prepare to celebrate spring. We are overwhelmed with feelings of gratitude for the promise of renewed life. During such a bright, vibrant and lively time of year, we focus on our spiritual and emotional rebirth. As new herbs, flowers, and plants begin to awaken and sprout new life, we as well begin to celebrate new ideas, creations, and practices. It is very important as practitioners that we spend time during the season to embrace the beautiful journey ahead, knowing that each season our knowledge runs deeper, our intuition grows stronger, and our perception of gratitude overflows. In this truly joyful collection, we celebrate the essence of renewal in its most natural and ancient form. In this box are as follows. Uh, we have basil. Um, da, 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 da. It's got some instructions about this. Um, basil herbal grimoire artwork. Yes, we received that. Spring green man plaque. Yes, we did. Spring blessings ritual incense sticks. Um, growth and renewal mini spell candle. Spring blessings magical anointment oil. Um, it is basil, white tea, and bergamot. So bergamot it has like a hint of like citrus to it. So that's very nice. Um, very fresh, very fresh. Uh, we included basil leaves and inside the oil you also find a Lumerian quartz. Uh, Pagan Tree of Life Book of Shadows artwork. Yes, we received all of those. So a wonderful springtime energy box. I'm really excited. The basil is definitely going to get used. All of this stuff is definitely going to get used. I'm going to find a place to hang our adorable plaque. Um, and, you know, Rich's Roots, um, you know, it is one of the more inexpensive subscription boxes, which is why I get it because I don't you know, have a ton of money. Um, the Witch's Moon looks lovely, but it's just like outside of my price range. But if you have like a little bit of money for subscription boxes, no, they don't sponsor me. Uh, I think this one's like a good bang for your buck. You get like an incense, a candle. There's usually like a piece of crystal or jewelry. Um, there's always herbs in it. So especially right now with not a lot of us being able to go out, it's nice to have some supplies kind of come to your door so it's a lovely little surprise to get every month so um, if you are interested on the patreon this month we are working with mars we're working on expressing our warrior energy our inner warrior spirit in the coven and then i also have opened up a new level on patreon where we are diving deep into the tarot for the next six months we're going to be diving deep looking at the tarot, uh, looking at just, I'm going to be talking about things like the history of tarot, the major arcana, the minor arcana, going through them all, the court cards, as well as how to do spreads and read the cards. So it's like a beginner's sort of deep dive into the tarot. If you're interested in that, you can check it out on the Patreon, as well as I'm also offering on my um, Etsy, I'm starting to do sinistry charts, which is where you compare your birth chart with another person's birth chart uh, to see what, what areas of compatibility you have. And it's not just for romance. It can be for any kind of relationship. It's going to be at a low price because I just started doing these. Um, and then they're going to go up at the end of the month. So if you're interested, check those things out. But otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Thanks for all the lovely comments. And um, just, you know, you guys are great. Wonderful. Thank you. Um, and as always, peace and love and love.